Jonah really liked his vine, and then the worm took away the vine. And God, in Jonah chapter 4, verse 10 and 11, confronts Jonah and says, Jonah, you are very concerned about losing this vine. But in essence, you don't really have much concern over the 120,000 people in Nineveh who can't tell their right hand from their left. How do we honor God? What shifts are needed? For Jonah, uh, a big shift was needed because he was more concerned about things than people. Have you ever made that shift uh, where you just know things have your attention, your heart, way more than they should? It could be your home or something in your home or a car. It could be the bank account, a phone. There's things that we love and overlove, where as opposed to giving that same compassion and time and energy to people. So maybe it's your family, maybe it's friends, maybe it's people who don't know the Lord. But what's a specific example today of a shift you can make? Loving a thing less, loving some people more. That's the way God was redirecting Jonah's heart, and that shift honors God.